Well, that's the end of the Young Stars Classic for the Edmonton Oilers with a 5-2 victory over the Vancouver Canucks to go a perfect 3-0. and And I don't know if they designate winners for this tournament, but that would ultimately make them the winners. The only team to go undefeated. Tony Barr here alongside 630 Chad's Cam Moon. And Cam, it was the usual suspects at work once again. Of course, that top line making waves. Dylan Holloway with an absolute beauty. Well, Dylan Holloway, throughout this entire tournament, just that, that speed, that ability to keep plays alive. And yeah. I thought he did that in this game more than a few times and resulted in sometimes opportunity and sometimes goals. Uh, the one where he took it to the net and was able to muscle that underneath the Seelovs. That was, it was a tremendous effort. But it was time and time again in this game where he was able to keep plays alive because he just works so hard and and that speed it's a lot to handle that entire line though James yeah. Hamblin Xavier Borgo a great pressure in the offensive zone uh, lots of skill on that line we expected him to be good they absolutely yeah. were good he was joking uh, behind us while we were doing player interviews he said we only got one this weekend did Xavier Borgo but hey one always better sure. than zero that line was terrific all week long one player that you want to talk about Max Warner, a uh, player uh, in the WHL, and mm -hmm. he seems to be a little bit of a late bloomer. I know the Oilers yeah. scouting staff is very pleased with his development down in Moose Jaw. What did you see from him throughout this weekend? Well, and he was paired with Philip Broberg, so yeah. you're paired with a, a veteran player that's played NHL games, but but Max Warner just showed some poise, some physical play. It's yeah. big hits in this game here today, uh, but just smart. Just smart with the puck yeah. and smart in his own end. A guy that's come a long ways in a short amount of time, seventh round pick in yeah. 21 for Edmonton, and just continues to develop. And I, you know, it's amazing when you can see a guy that's come as far as he has in a yeah. year's time. We saw him uh, it, in rookie camp last year, and he's just just a tremendous development and and he'll be a big part of a moose jaw team this yeah. year i can't wait to see where he is a year from now yeah or his management very pleased with mm -hmm. his development as i already mentioned still don't know how he scored it was a weird one but Warner gets on the board here tonight for uh the Oilers in their victory third person i want to talk about Goaltender Ryan Fanti, he was sensational. Uh, I know Colin Chalk mentioned post game that uh, he stopped three grade A saves. He had 16 total, a perfect night for him from the first half of the hockey game. I mean, the Oilers signed him to an entry level contract last March, got in a game in Bakersfield. What did the Oilers have in this netminder? Well, he, he had a great effort tonight, yeah. I thought. I mean, he, there were some outstanding opportunities early in this game for the Vancouver Canuck rookies and and Ryan Fanti was just sharp I mean, he was just his position was really good I didn't uh, kick out too many rebounds I thought the rebound control was good but just that anticipation of the play yeah. he was in the right spot before the puck got there like he wasn't uh, reacting in behind it and thus scrambly yeah. no he was on it tracking the puck while getting to his position and then able to make a save he actually made it look easy yeah. because he was in position as well as he was. So, yeah, for a guy coming out of university hockey from uh, Minnesota Duluth, uh, this will be his first you know, real year pro. I mean, played one game last year, but he'll get that opportunity in Bakersfield. A terrific night for Fanti, a terrific night for the Oilers, a terrific weekend for Oilers and Oilers TV. Uh, the Oilers go 3-0 and on the ice. We go 3-0 and in securing Cam Moon for post-game coverage. Cam, always appreciate your time. All right, thanks.